just the, the relaxation, the beauty, the quiet, uh, the, just a place you can come and just be. Located in Sulaco, it's all the elements you would expect when exploring northwestern Ontario. From the beautiful trails and trees to the fresh air and water. And the best part for residents living in our area, it's not far off the beaten trail. Oh, Cedar Bay is a recreation complex just north of the town, within the town limits. Uh, it was uh, created back in the mid-70s um, as a wilderness camp. Over the years, um, you know, with municipalities having more and more uh, strains on their budgets. You see, this facility started to to uh, become run down. And uh, about the year of 2000, a group of citizens formed a coalition to revitalize Cedar Bay. Run in part by the Friends of Cedar Bay, the area is made up of walking trails and ski trails that connect visitors to its beauty. From geocaching, hiking, horseback riding, and swimming in the summer to snowshoeing and skiing in the winter. We're about the wilderness, basically. We're a town in the middle of the wilderness. And that's one of our biggest resources. Not everybody, in fact, very few people can live on the lake. Very few people have homes large enough that they can have, um, you know, outdoor recreation opportunities for their children. And Cedar Bay is a, it's an opportunity for people to come for a walk, come out and have a picnic use the ski, ski trails and most of it's for the most part it's free. For more information on Cedar Bay in Sulacote and everything it offers visit cedarbay.org. This is a gold mine right under our our nose and um, that's why I feel so um, proud to be able to be part of it because um, it's something for the people here now. For Go on Shaw TV, I'm Tommy Johnson.